hello guys welcome to my channel today we are going to see how to fix the runtime error whenever you launch the application you got the error the application has requested the runtime to terminate it in as usual way let's fix it guys the first solution is to clear cache of ubisoft to do this you just need to right click on the start icon and select run in run window you just need to type percentage local update percentage again click on ok in here you just need to search for ubisoft game launcher right click on it and delete it guys we have cleared the ubisoft cache files now you can check if the problem solved or not if the problem not solved let's move on to the second solution guys if you have installed this particular yen protest online security and voice meter application then you just need to uninstall these both programs guys because this is the major cause for microsoft visual c runtime error after uninstalling both the application you can check if the problem solved or not if the problem not solved let's move on to the third solution guys you just need to right click on the start icon and select run in run window you just need to type app wiz.cpl click on ok in here you just need to scroll down in order to install the latest version of microsoft visual c++ you just need to delete all the versions of microsoft visual c++ installed on your pc you just need to select one by one and uninstall it after getting delete all of these you just need to close stuff here now check my video description for this link used in my video you just need to scroll down select x64.exe link after getting download done you just need to select show in folder you just need to run the setup file this will install the latest microsoft visual c++ for you guys select next and follow the on-screen instructions and after getting installed done you just need to close stuff here go to search menu and type cmd right click on the command prompt and select run as administrator and select yes now you just need to check my video description for this command used in my video copy and paste it one by one after pasting these two commands you just need to close it up here and go ahead and restart your pc after restarting your pc you can check if the problem solved or not i hope one of these solutions fixed your problem guys if the video helped you don't forget to leave a like guys you can also subscribe me and support me guys thank you